Uh, okay guys, so here we are. We're gonna do a very first in uh, XG45 uh, restorations. Uh, my grandson got him a lawnmower and he wants to do a will it run on it. So I am not gonna say any more. I'm just gonna turn it over to him and let him take it from here, all right? Here we go. Hello everybody. Um, welcome to Exit 45. My name is Bryson and I'm gonna see if this one will run. And it's right here. Okay. Um, so what I'm gonna do here is take this um, cover off um, um, and I have to take this screw off so I can take it off. I can see the There you go. Both of these screws on off, so now I can take this hood off. So now um, we got the cover off. Now I'm going to take off the um, fuel tank. Usually there was a screw that was holding this on, but um, I got, got it off, so let's take it off. Say it again. So um, I'm going to take these sparks off to see if there's any um, sparks left. The other end. The other end. Show them the other end. That's one that makes the spark. Here it is. Does it need to be cleaned? Mm, yeah. It does need to be cleaned. Alright, let's go ahead and do that before we check for spark. Let's clean that spark plug up. Alright. Everybody, we got it clean. Okay, here we go. And try that. Yep, 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 yep. Spark. Spark. Saw it. I saw it spark. Okay. We have sparks, everybody. <laughs> we got some sparks. So here is what is 
wrong with it. There's like a kind of nest in here you can see. And it is not good at all. Not good. So, I'm gonna take two bolts mm -hmm. off of this and then clean it out. Just like there. Oh, it's the on top. It was hard to take this off because there was a tiny screw down here. So we had to use that. That is in my dad's hand. If I just come off with me. Time to take it off. Now I'm going to take the carburetor off. There's a top bolt right here that is not letting me pull it off. Let's see. There you go. Is that, is that be? Take the carburetor off. Right. Yay, we took it out. We took it out. Yay, we took it Took. Yay. Here it is. Now I'm gonna clean this out. No, it needs good cleaning from here. Right. See. See. Dirt. Always wear your safety glasses. Now we got this clean, we're gonna put it back together. This in there so it it up for us. Yeehaw! There it is. Boom! Yeah! Hold it right there for now. I'm going to get the bolt for it. So I'm going to put the gas tank back on. Big bolt first.
Thank you. Yep, we should move this party in the, inside a little bit. Yeah, okay, let's put it in. Put it inside. Right now. Well, now we can't move them on. Well, well, now it's raining, so now when it's good, I can't mark. Hope it won't rain in the morning. Well, now, now I'm going to put the cover back on. What? I'm screwing these two bolts back in. Push it in so you can't oh, bite yourself with your hands. With your hands with your hands. You don't so you can't. Can't. Alright, now you got Easy. Break it. That's it. That's it. Okay, back on. Yes! We made we need a put gas in it! We need to check the oil. Let's check the oil. 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 We got some oil in there. We need to get oil and gas for this lawn. We're gonna try to make it start. Not good. What just happened? He broke it. He broke it. That makes me scared. Hello, everybody, again. 
um, today we um, we built this, and uh, now we know that it runs. And we did a couple pulls, and then and that broke it. So, um, I hope you um liked my video. Bye. Okay, guys. As you can tell, we got rained out on the Willet Run, and my son broke the uh, pull cord, so it did crank up a couple of times. So technically, we got a Willet Run. It, yes, it will. Uh, but it, he did great. You know, he had a great time, and uh, Bryson just had a ball with it. So I appreciate you guys watching. This is all about Bryson and letting him do this. He, he wanted so bad to do one. So there it is. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you on the next video. All right, bye.